Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. She's worked with some of music's biggest stars and even sang back up for the incomparable mm. Jennifer Hudson. Since then, uh, Kyla <laughs> Jay has stepped into the spotlight, making it all the way to the top three in season 14, The Voice. Yes. Take a look. So Yes, honey. You better. Please welcome the star that continues to shine, Kyla J. Yeah. <laughs> and we got to walk out here. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Yes. Hello. Hi, good morning. Hi. How are you? It's so a pleasure. How, how are you, baby? Yes. Well, so how are you? Look at that voice, yeah. honey. It's something serious. Come Thank on, Hal. You. Look yeah. at you. Come on, Hal. Now and listen, I knew I was going to be on the show with some divas, so oh, I, had to, I had to match. Yes. yes. And you do it well. Yes. Thank you. Well, listen, you have uh, sang us down mm -hmm. on The Voice. Thank we love your you. voice. It's so unique and just amazing. Thank How about you. that? When did you get your start? When did you know, like, you know what? I think this singing thing mm, could work for me. I'm a church girl. Yeah. I'm born mm -hmm. and raised in church. Mm -hmm. um, my family did everything to music. We learned how to clean, how to shop, how to be a pedestrian. Like, yes. <laughs> everything was to music. So yeah. it kind of, my mother taught us very early that that was our language. Uh -huh. That's how we communicated. So it just became a part of who I was. Yeah. Now, who gave you your very first break? Now, I know you were mm -hmm. on, you know, The Voice, of mm -hmm. course, but who gave you your very first break? Bobby Jones. Bobby Jones, I was stop. on Bobby Jones Gospel for nine years. What? Out of Nashville. Yes, ma'am. Wow. I sang with the super choir. I was the youngest thing, tallest, with the biggest hair. Yeah. <laughs> so, so I sang, sang with Bobby Jones for nine years. He took me all over the world. Yeah. And, um, just, I, I tell everybody, if you can make it in church, honey, you can make it anywhere. Yes, yes you can. Oh, and, and, that's true. And talk, yeah. The church people will, honey, they, they, they will read you down. It honey. Will, it's good and bad. It's good and bad. <laughs> You talk to us a little bit about that, like how gospel has continued to inspire you and really kind of be what you need it to be for you in this industry. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. It, um, when you realize gospel is not its own genre, it's really who you are inherently. Mm -hmm. So you live your life a little differently because gospel is who you are. So who you represent is bigger than you could yes. ever be. Well, that's what it's supposed to be. Uh, listen. Come on now. I'm, did As I say a word? Be. You did say okay. a word. It, it, it kind of got in you just okay. a little <laughs> bit. <laughs> I felt that thing right, just a little bit. Right, just a little so bit. It, you, should, you should move a little differently. And so because it's faith-based and because everything, anytime, ministry, comes in many forms. You don't have to beat people over the head. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't sing gospel music every time I was on the voice stage, right. but I'm God's child. So you're yes. going to feel him. You may not mm -hmm. recognize it. You may not know why you feel like that. The best compliment was from a Jewish guy. Mm. He came to me and he was just crying and he, and I was singing. It may have, it may have been, let it be. Uh -huh. And he said, I don't know why I feel like this. Wow. I don't know why I feel like this. And I said, well, that's okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's okay. Yeah. Because as Christians, you can just live. Mm -hmm. And you can just live a good life. And someone should be touched by just a good life. All right, then. You, better, right, you, life. you better speak a word <laughs> down to the sister <laughs> circle today. Okay? That's good stuff. It is good yes. stuff. Well, Kyla, many people think, you know, your success just came easy. It was overnight. Mm. You know, would you, would you express to the people the level of sacrifices it took for you to be here today? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. I think um, everyone's journey is different mm -hmm. and a lot of starving artists I listen mm -hmm. I'm not gonna starve mm -hmm. I want to maintain this health okay. <laughs> I love so it. that's that's not going to be my testimony uh -huh. but I've, I've lived in a car I've worked three jobs I have gone without um, I was a minister of music at my church for about 10 years and in ministry it does not pay Mm -hmm. it, it really doesn't. You know, you give your sacrifice unto the Lord, and mm -hmm. I hope you get dinner tonight. Right. It's kind Amen. of right. that wow. juncture. Um, but you learn to, to appreciate the simple things. Yes. You learn to take a little mm -hmm. and make it a lot. Mm -hmm. you, learn, you learn how to be kind mm -hmm. because tomorrow may be different. Yes. So I, I actually take all of those challenges and I think they've made me the best person because I got to struggle. Absolutely. And had to kind of 
you know, look mm -hmm. around yeah. and, yeah. and wonder where it was coming from. And mm -hmm. I mean, it's, faith is not faith unless it's walked, mm -hmm. yes, unless it's tried. It. Yes. So going without, you won't appreciate having. Right. right. Mm. Tell us about your relationship with your Shiro, mm -hmm. Jennifer Hudson. Jennifer Hudson is everything you think she is. Mm -hmm. She is kind and family oriented, but that child is an artist. Mm. I have never met anyone who can sing the same way at 4 a.m. that they do at 10 p.m. Wow. Oh, wow. I mean, she, I say, oh, obviously, your, your vocal cords are steel. Like, mm -hmm. there's, there's just nothing that can penetrate them. But she has created a family around her where she sews into you yeah. and pushes you. And I am honored to yeah. be associated with her. And I told her, now listen, I know I'm doing stuff, but you call me, honey, when you're working. Cause <laughs> That's right. <laughs> let's go. You know what? You're so good. We're going to have more with you when we return. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Social Life. yeah. College Awesome. Day. Yes. <laughs> that shot. Mm -hmm. Keep it on it me. <laughs> Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. We are continuing our conversation with the incomparable Kyla J. Yes, because <laughs> yes. that voice is incomparable, baby. It really listen, is. How much did they pay you to no, talk to me right there? <laughs> listen, I got a nice little salary. You know what I'm saying? I can take care of my family. But they didn't pay me to say that. I promise you. Stop. Oh my I don't God. know what's wrong with me today. I'm crazy. Going. It's fine. Kyla. Yes, ma'am. Season 14 yeah. of yes. The Voice. Mm -hmm. You made it to the top three. Yes, My God, you had stiff competition. You Absolutely. really did. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. What was your experience like on The Voice? It was amazing. Yeah. I, I think um, the platform was already overwhelming. Okay. And so anytime I have the ability to sing, I'm going to take it. Of but course. finding out very early that African American women don't win the show mm -hmm. was all I needed. Oh. So every wait time, a minute, wait a minute, well, hold, wait a hold the line now. You ain't gonna drop that and ain't gonna tell us There's about it. No African American now, woman has ever won the show. Oh, no, ever, right? Won oh, the I show. thought you said couldn't. Oh. oh no, no, they don't. Big voices. That's what they said. Strate strategically or traditionally, rather, big voices don't win. Mm. I said, oh, okay, that's fine. So we'll have you on for entertainment. So it doesn't matter what you think you're gonna have me on for. Right. We're gonna see what God does. Amen. How about that? So I had a good time. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, with that, you have new music. I do have Tell new music. Tell us all about it. I do. I, I, it is a feel-good throwback to the things I grew up listening to. Mm -hmm. So my very first single was right after the show in June. I put out Daydreaming okay. mm -hmm. in tribute to Aretha Franklin. Yes. Because she was such a big part of my journey. Mm -hmm. And she heard it and loved it and God. told me in her sassy way, oh, okay, well, you keep singing me. No, okay, good. <laughs> so she, you got the thumbs up from Aretha. Yes, ma'am. Okay. I That's did a big get the deal. thumbs up. That's and then the deal. next, it, it's just a, it kind of has a Shaka Khan feel. Mm -hmm. It's called Make Up Your Mind, and it's just something that you should feel good listening yeah. to. Yeah, absolutely. How do you use your platform to inspire others, Kyla? I think it's important anytime the world sees me, anytime anyone sees me, that you see me in confidence and that you understand if, if someone else my size or just dark skin or big hair yeah. or not that pretty or not feeling that well, that you can see yourself in me. Mm. Yes. Anytime. Anytime I am blessed to sing or stand, that someone feels better than wow, before they came. You are You're right with it. me. Yes, you are. All <laughs> the way. You can come back anytime, Kyla Jane. Thank Jane. you, ladies, Love your for spirit. having me. Make sure to please pick up her new single, Make Up Your Mind, available on all digital outlets.